And the 2023 LISD Secondary Teacher of the Year is Katie Bragg, Marcus Ninth Grade Campus. The stories that we got to hear tonight were amazing. And so I just, I'm proud to be a part of a district that is so exceptional, at which was evidenced by the events that we saw tonight. Teacher after teacher, just phenomenal stories. Teachers that love kids, it was amazing. When I think about Mrs. Bragg, the first thing that comes to my mind is how incredibly passionate she is. She's all in all the time. So my mom, she was a middle school teacher for a long time, and my dad was a coach and teacher my entire adolescence. And so I saw the relationships that they built with their students, and I realized that so much about teaching kids isn't content related. A lot of it is but so much is relationship building. Ms. Bragg gets to know her students like every single one of them. She takes her time with every single person to establish like a connection with all of them. She would always ask us about like how football season's going or other stuff, more like personal stuff before the school stuff she got to that, but she made it feel really comfortable in her classroom all the time, like making sure that we're like, we're good just as people before like her students. And I really appreciate that because every day it had me think, okay, I, I have a place I can go to that I'm like, comfortable with. A lot of the ways that I connect with them is trying to figure out what they're interested in and a lot of what they are interested in is not stuff that I would necessarily gravitate towards, but I do it anyway. So I read the books that they're reading, I watch the shows that they're watching, I listen to a lot of the music that they're listening to so that we can have those conversations. She was always into like me and Logan's interests. Like anytime we would like be like lip syncing a song, she'll ask what song it is and she will like also say, oh, I love that song too. And then we would all listen it together. And she would always use examples from like TV shows or other movies or books from other stuff that like is kind of more our age. And I think that really helped me like enjoy stuff and understand it better. I don't think that kids don't like writing or reading. I think they, they don't like the things that they have read or the things that they have written about. When you give them opportunity and choice and the ability to explore and to play around with things, they, they do like writing, they do like reading things that they enjoy. Before this class, I definitely was not an English person. I didn't like writing or reading, but by the end of class, I finished like a lot of books. She helped me find out like what genres I like and writing especially, like she made me like enjoy writing. I want them to feel treasured in this environment. And so by affirming the things that they're interested in, I know that they feel valued by me and they will work harder for me. We all work harder for people when we know that they love us. She's one of the nicest people I've ever met in my entire life. Like. No one in my life has ever treated me like how she has. She's always there for me. She's always there for any one of her students, regardless of how close she is with them. Ms. Brad doesn't care who you are, like what your past is. No matter what, she'll always treat you with respect if you would treat her with respect. No matter like where you come from, what your ethnicity is, like she does not care. She loves everyone for who they are. She's really a champion for them and their hearts and making sure that they feel like they have a place to be safe. What I'm passionate about is the notion of all kids. They all have beauty in them. They all do really cool things. And I want them all to be seen and heard. I want every kid at Marcus to have a place. I want kids to feel like this is their home away from home. I'm grateful for my kids. I'm grateful for my team. I'm grateful for the professionals that I get to work with daily and my campus. And I always say, if you can't teach in LISD, you can't teach anywhere because we have everything at our disposal and it's, it's an amazing place to work.